What's up guys welcome to Tech Academy. In this video I am going to talk about LRU page replacement algorithm. LRU stands for least recently used. It replaces the page that hasn't been referenced for the longest time. I have also made a video on first in first out page replacement algorithm. I will put the link on the screen and also in the description bar below so that you can check it out. Problem with FIFO is it may replace heavily used pages. So. I'll explain what is LRU using an example. So this is the page frame and these are the page requests made by a program or a process. So in this video, I'll tell you what is LRU, what is page fault, what is page hit and also advantages and disadvantages of LRU. So let's get started. First, there is nothing there in the page frame and the current page is 7. So, 7 will get added here, but there will be a page fault. What is a page fault? The page which is requested by the program is not present in the RAM. That means there is a page fault. 7 was not present in the page frame, so there was a page fault. The next page is 0. So, there is a space for two more pages so 7 will remain there and 0 will get added here and again there will be a page fault the next page is 1 which is not in the page frame but there is a space for one more page so 7 and 0 will remain there and 1 will get added and there will be a page fault so I have given red color where there is a page fault and blue color for rest of the pages and green color for page hits now the page frame is full and the next page is 2 which is not there in the page frame. So we need to remove one page from the page frame so that we can add 2 there. So we'll see from here 1 is the most recently used page then 0 and then 7. So 7 will get removed and 2 will get added there. So 2 will get added here and there will be a page fault because 2 was not present in the page frame and 0 and 1 will remain there. The next page is 0 which is already present. So this is known as page hit. So 2, 0, 1 will remain there and the page which is requested by the program is present in the RAM that's why it is a page hit. The next page is 3 which is not there and the page frame is full. So we'll see again which is the least recently used page. So 0 is the most recently used then 2 and then 1. So 1 will get removed and 3 will get added here. So we'll add 2 and 0 will remain there and 3 will get added here and there will be a page fault. The next page is 0 which is already present so there will be a page hit. The next page is 4 which is not present in the page frame. So we'll see which is the least recently used. 0 is the most recently used then 3 then again 0 and then 2. So 2 will get removed. So we'll add 4 here, there will be a page fault and 0 and 3 will remain there. The next page is 2 which is not there. So we'll again see 4 is the most recently used then 0 and then 3. So 3 will get removed. So 4 and 0 will remain there, 3 will get removed and 2 will get added there. So there will be a page fault. The next page is 3 which is not present in the page frame. So again we'll see which is the least recently used page. 2 is the most recently used, then 4 and then 0. So 0 will get removed. So 4 will remain there, here 3 will get added and 2 will remain there and there will be a page fault. The next page is 0 which is not present in the page frame. So we'll see. 3 is the most recently used, then 2 and then 4. So 4 will get removed and 0 will get added there. So 0 will get added here. There will be a page fault and 3 and 2 will remain there. The next page is 3 which is present in the page frame. So 0, 3 and 2 will remain there and there will be a page hit. The next page is 2 which is present in the page frame. So again 0, 3, 2 will remain there and there will be a page hit. 
the next page is one which is not present in the page frame so again we'll see which is the least recently used page two is the most recently used page then three and then zero so we'll remove zero and add one there so one will get added here there will be a page fault and three and two will remain there the next page is two which is already present in the page frame so one three two will remain there and there will be a page hit so now one two three four five six seven eight nine ten there are ten page faults and one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen fifteen fifteen pages so this is how lru works now the disadvantage of using lru is there is more overhead that means we need to keep track of when the pages were used so as you can see when there is a page fault we need to see which page came when so this is called overhead in case of fifo the overhead is less because we don't need to keep track of pages and also lru is difficult to implement so that's all for today i hope you understood what is lru what is page fault page hit and the advantages and disadvantages so thank you for watching this video make sure you subscribe to my channel and if you like this video hit the like button bye